All right, so uh, congratulations and welcome welcome to QBA Family Beth. We are so glad and happy and honored that you've uh, chosen QBA to be part of your business. So uh, today we'll be doing a group interview. Um, I'm still waiting for two more VAs, but I think we can get started. We are two minutes behind. Let me just check quickly. Okay, I'm about to end now. All right, so here is the other VA. Okay, welcome, Marisol. So uh, before we get started, uh, I would appreciate if you can share a bit of yourself and your business background, please, so we would know more about you. Me? Hey. Yes, please. Okay. Um, I, I, uh, hi, everyone. Thank you so much for being here today. I really appreciate it. Um, I've been a, um, a coach, uh, um, an executive coach for um, 10 years now. And I've, I, at the same time as I've been working as a coach, I've also had a consultancy business that I've developed. And because a consultancy business requires so much of me doing one-on-one -on -one, um, things with, um, with teams or with organisations, um, what I'm wanting to do is to kind of find a way to do less of that and to, to do more of my coaching and to build that up. And so um, I'm currently undertaking and I'm learning all about it. So I see, you know, you guys as being able to travel this journey with me and, and we'll learn together. Um, I've, I'm currently looking at ways that I can grow my coaching business um, so that I have more um, group coaching. So it's about building up my profile um, on Facebook and LinkedIn. But it's also then about finding people to come to my um, come to my Facebook group and to then begin that process of marketing to them so that I can take them up, you know, what everybody calls the, the ascension model. Now, although I have an established coaching business, Largely what happens is that, you know, if I had been um, coaching any one of you, I've made such an impact on your life that um, you refer me to somebody else. Um, and so I haven't learned that whole sales process because by the time that person um, comes to me, they're most of the way towards the sale anyway. And so there's a lot that I need to learn about that selling and there's a lot that I need to learn and I'm excited to learn um, about the process of running um, group coaching, um, group coaching um, on, a, on a regular basis and the kinds of programs that I need to offer into that. Um, I, some days um, I feel as though I'm all over this and I've got this and I'm really good at this and I, yeah, I'm on top of it. And other times I'm just kind of going, you know what, I'm a little bit scared here. And I refer to that as kind of being happy scared. Um, I, I, I'm, quite, um, I'm quite keen to grow with someone, um, recognizing that sometimes I'll get it wrong and, and you'll need to remind me about that. And other times you, you might get it wrong and I'll need to remind you about that. But we'll keep each other kind of accountable. Um, before I started my coaching, um, I worked for many years um, in the education system. In Australia, it's what's called um, TAFE. So it's between high schools and universities. And I was a faculty director. So I've got a really extensive background. I've also owned and operated my own businesses as well as that. So I've got this extensive background um, and it's about me moving into that space of doing um, much more group work so that I'm leveraging my time and also um, identifying opportunities to run um, online workshops and in-person workshops. So 
Yeah, that's me. Um, oh, I can tell you some more about me. I live in, in um, on the Sunshine Coast, which is about two hours. It's in Queensland and it's about two hours above where Jason is. Jason's on the Gold Coast. So I'm kind of, yeah, two hours um, further north than that. Um, I have um, two sons who live and work in Brisbane, which is the city that sits between where Jason is and where I am. Um, and um, my partner and I live here and both um, work mostly um, from home. So, yeah, I'm excited. Well, thank you so much for sharing, Beth. It seems that you've got a lot of uh, things to offer to your clients, so that's, that's great to know. Okay, so uh, yeah, let's get started. Uh, we have four lovely VAs that you can talk to right now. We have Rodora, PJ, Marisol, and Amir. As I mentioned on the chat, this will be a, a round robin style interview. So just say your question and they will answer in take turns. So um, yeah, we can get started. Um, yeah, I'll just Turn off my video, Beth, and uh, just listen to your interview, and we'll be back as soon as you're done with the interview, okay? Uh, okay. Um, I'm, I'm not um, real sure about exactly what questions I should be asking, so I'm happy for you to make some suggestions. All right. So you have not watched the uh, video yet? The, the I, I, I watched the first one the first few I think did I need to watch another one I apologize I thought I'd watched enough not a problem at all Beth so uh yeah let's get started um uh, uh, who wants to go first uh, kindly introduce yourself and uh, tell us a bit of your experience as a VA and what are your skills that you think can help Beth to grow her uh, community or uh, the business so who would like to go first? Gentlemen first. <laughs> Can you go, Amir? Uh, yes, I'll be more than happy to go first. All right, so uh, good afternoon or good morning. I'm not sure. So hi, Beth. My name is Amir. And I have uh, I am a virtual assistant who have experience uh, as a social media manager for, I think, almost a year and two months now. Mm -hmm. Mostly focused on LinkedIn and Facebook as well. Uh, I also know how to use uh, a, Weber, a Weber system. Yeah. Sorry if I butchered that one. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it. So I have experience on that software since I recommended it to my previous client as well mm -hmm. because of the features that it has. And what else? I uh, I have also experience in lead, uh, in lead generation. Yeah. And I'm uh, if this will help, I also know how to do content creation, which I think will help definitely definitely on managing your social media pages. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. All right. Who's next? Yeah. Who's next? Fedora? Hello. Um, uh, you can call me Roda. I have experience in um, social media management for a year. I have been assisting coaches and um, business owners in lead generation as well, uh, content mm -hmm. creation, graphics design using Canva. And I have experience in the tool that you are using. I use it to um, schedule posts uh, for my client. And I am comfortable in handling CRM. I know uh, I, uh, I am knowledgeable also in LinkedIn, um, Pinterest, uh, Instagram, and Facebook. So I know strategies how to grow community on LinkedIn mm -hmm. and uh, as per experience I have experience in SEO I have handling uh, Shopify um, group card and Etsy um, generating topics to their website so that's me 
Thank you so much. All right. Hello, Beth. Good morning there. Uh, my name is CJ. Uh, so I have been working for around nine to 10 years uh, in the industry. So I started working in the corporate industry for around six years uh, where I work as a graphic designer at the same time a uh, marketing specialist. And I also have the experience in uh, working in a food chain as a marketing supervisor for around one year. And then when the pandemic happens, I switch into a work at home setup where I work as a virtual assistant and I specialize as social media management. So I handle dif different platforms, Facebook, uh, Instagram, LinkedIn, YouTube. And then I also do lead generation and appointment setting and also graphic design and basic video editing. So uh, I'm also a self-starter so I can easily learn uh, uh, different tools that, uh, uh, that a client are using. And then there, I'm really into communication, into community as well. So with my previous client, I handle his uh, Facebook group accounts where I gain 500 quality members in just a month. So that's one of the strategies that we're doing. So I guess that's it. Thank you. Thank you. So I'm the last one. Hi, Beth. Hi. My name is Marisol. So I've been working as a virtual assistant for almost one year. So my key expertise are lead generation, data entry, social media management, um, basic video, and um, photo editing. So in lead generation, um, I build connection by using um, true Facebook, Instagram. Um, I am very familiar using um, Instagram in building connections um, and by generating leads. So I also have an experience in email marketing by using um, Instantly and Lemlist before. And I am very familiar with the spreadsheet. I am also an explorer. Um, I can I can easily adopt when um, I can easily adopt in um, in different CRM tools or in different um, communications that you are using. So I, I am very flexible on on those tools that you are currently using and also in um, yeah in on the time zone also I am very flexible mm -hmm. so you can communicate you can communicate with me anytime so I can. I will respond as much as I can. Um, and then um, I do social media management also. So creating content, graphics in Canva. And right now I am exploring in Adobe Photoshop. So I am studying Adobe Photoshop right now by using um, tutorial in YouTube. And aside from that, I also have the experience in cold calling before. That is my first experience as a virtual assistant. So I started as cold caller. Um, but right now I I, uh, I am focusing in non-voice. So I do also appointment setting using organic outreaching. That's it. Thank you, Ms. Beth. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so... Um... Do you have any software about that you're currently using that you wanted to know if they know anything about it? Um, I use um, Aweber for, I have a database um, of around about um, a thousand people and I email them um, on a regular basis. So um, if someone knows how to use that, that's good. Um, my my um, my um, website is with oh, can't think of it. Wasn't it used to be with Squarespace, but now it's with someone else. Um, who else might look? Who else might do website? Yeah, I'm, I'm here. 
Uh, yes, I have experience in doing web development. As yeah. if you don't mind me sharing, uh, during my college years, I've been studying uh, computer science. So yeah. I have knowledge in programming and website development as well. Okay. Um, sometimes it just needs to be adjusted and I forget what, um, what it's with. Um, okay, thank you. Um, and um, I, I also have um, lead pages to, de to design um, um, pages for people to register and programs. And sometimes I use all of these things. I don't necessarily always use them. Um, it depends on what's happening. Um, I have a YouTube channel um, and um, I use um, Calendly for, um, for people. It's an online calendar that people can book. I've got both Zoom and Skype. Um, and I also use, if I'm doing a webinar, I use GoToWebinar um, for, um, for that purpose. So if, uh, like, I'm really comfortable for each of you, if you think there's anything else that you'd like to add, um, based on, uh, on top of what you've already said, I'm happy for you to take turns at adding some more to what you've told me. Um, oh, yeah. Quick question. Uh, sorry to yeah. cut you off. That's all right. Have you already said? Have you already set it up a landing page on a Weber, uh, a Weber or a Weber? I'm sorry. No, no, I don't have a landing page on a Weber. Um, since I started using it, like I, I did a whole lot of training to learn about the basics of using it, and there have been a lot of advancements in the last. Um, probably 18 months to two years and and I just haven't had the time to to learn how to do those extra things so at the moment I'm not fully using Aweber for all that it could be used for so um, yeah there, there's plenty of opportunity to explore so when I talk about uh, this is for all of you when I talk about wanting to grow, there are some tools that I have um, that are there that are opportunity to, um, to do those things a little bit differently um, and to, to maximise the use of them um, is good. It's there. Um, does anybody else have any other questions or anything else they'd like to add to what they said? The first time. Um, if you want, uh, if you need some help with integrating your uh, Weber and WordPress, because I've just checked your website just now. It's and WordPress. Noticed, yeah, thank you. Yeah. I was just and finding I've, out what it was. And I've, I yeah, I've checked it just now and it's WordPress. <laughs> yeah. Um, if you need the help with integrating those, then I can definitely help you with that. Okay, so that's something to think about. Thank you. Uh, does anybody else have any questions that they'd like to ask me or anything else that they'd like to add? Um, I'd like to add, I have a client before that um, just like you, she didn't know how to use the Bustado. So I learned it on my own, um, create, lead capture uh, packages and sort of the stuff that uh, I learned through um, searching on my own, being a resourceful. So um, I'm willing to uh, learn from, uh, learn more about a Weber and I want to um, maximize it. I think um, creating landing pages, I can and learn those. So um, when it comes to, I actually have goals that um, my primary um, goals as a virtual assistant is not to just earn money, but to help a client uh, scale their business so that mm -hmm. I can just actually a, for me, a, a fulfillment, a sense of fulfillment that um, this is what I do. 
that's it. Lovely, thank you. Anyone else? Um, me, I just, I just want to add also that I build web design or I design a website for my previous client. Actually, there are two websites that I designed for her. So um, I think I, I am not, um, I am not, I am not very familiar with the, um, with the software or, or the programming in the website. But I, on my own, I can, I, um, I, sorry about, about the background. Um, yeah, yeah, um, I source or I watch YouTube tutorial on how to, um, set up the website or design a website. And, and then, um, I ask also the help of my client, um, some inputs on what we will be, what we will be include on her website content. And that's it. Um, the final output is, um, she's happy about the result on what I've done. So, yeah, um, I am very, I am very willing to learn, um, about the Aweber, um, since, um, Lemlist and Instantly is, um, is also a new tools for me, but I also um, get the chance to study them so that I can use them very well. Mm-hmm. But and and that that's it. I, I think I can also easily um I can also easily um call this familiarize with the Aweber since I am a fast learner and very flexible. That's okay. it. Thank, Thank you. you. Anyone else? CJ, did you want to add anything else? Uh, yes. <laughs> uh, actually, as a virtual assistant, it is already given but that we have to learn different kind of tools in a specific period of time or immediately. Yeah. So, yeah. So, I... In my two years of experience as a VA, I already experienced uh, learning different tools all by myself. Just like I, I, I actually don't have the uh, skills on learning a Weber, but I do believe it's about email automation, something like that. So I can definitely help you with that. And then I think what you need uh, is someone who can help you organize with your team, with your uh, system and how to run your business in a smooth and uh, smooth sailing way. So uh, I'm really into organizational development, uh, system development. So we, I, I actually have uh, make a playbook, a hybrid playbook together with my client. Actually, um, he actually uh, asking that kind of process with me before we're going to end. So I'm I'm very much uh, uh, okay to give it to him. And before I let him go, we, we will set everything up. So there. So I think what you need is someone who can help you. And I'm the kind of person who is really into communication and very much transparent. And I love talking with people. I love, uh, I love working. So there. So I think uh, that's what I can help you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much. My goal would be that we would we start with the 20 hours and my goal would be to grow. Um, you know, I, I'm, I'm, I'm invested in, um, in this program, but there are other programs that I've invested in so that I can learn the process of um, lead generation and, and building Um, my group coaching calls and and all of those kinds of things so it's a steep learning curve for me and what I would be looking for is the right person to uh, to come along that journey with me Um, and and um, you know sometimes um, sometimes we might be frantically busy and other times we might not be quite so busy but it's about establishing and reaching those KPIs and identifying why we might not be getting there or or what we can do to be able to to get there 
Um, and what's also really important to me is um, open and honest conversation and um, having fun. It's really important to have some fun along the way. Um, I, you know, I, I want it to be about um, about me supporting someone else, but that person also supporting me, so that it's a two way thing. Um, you know, I, I want someone who who has um, who who understands that that I want to grow my business and if I grow my business um, it benefits them as well as benefiting me definitely uh, Beth thank you so much so uh, ladies and uh, Amir do you have any questions for Beth before we wrap it up anything you wanted to ask all good <laughs> okay. All right. So, uh, yeah, we're we're all good. Do you have any other questions, Beth? Any anything no. you want to clarify? So, we're all good. No, I'm good. Okay, then. Thank, thank you all. Thank you all very much for your time. I appreciate you making time to come today. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate your time as well, Beth. And uh, well, the next step is, of course, for you to announce if you have decided the uh, who you wanted to work with. I can give you some time. You can sleep on it before you may tell us who you wanted to yep. work with. Okay. Um, what I'd like to do um, is have a, a quick conversation with you at some stage, if that's okay. Okay. Yeah, no yep. worries. No, no problem. All right, and um, and yeah. then, then we'll get it sorted. Okay. Thank you, guys. Uh, you can drop off now. Before. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your time. Bye bye. 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 I'm right. so sorry. I thought that I that you were going to ask the questions. So oh, no. you you then asked the question that I I'm thinking. Oh well, that's what I would ask. But maybe there's something different. Mm -hmm. So um, I apologise for not being across that. I've I've listened to, I think I've done the first three modules. With, with um, yeah. Mm. yeah so thank you for helping me out there I really appreciated that My pleasure. Um, I'm 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 wondering um whether um I'm wondering whether CJ might be someone who would be ideal um the challenge at like I love it when she says you know obviously you need to be organized because that's true um I like it when she talked about some of the past experience that she'd had um I wonder if she was able to take instruction whether there is a, a whether like how much experience have you guys